it's toe maintenance time again. Yesterday I showed you doing my pinky toe and today we're gonna do the rest of the toes except for the big toe. And I thought I'd continue the trend I started yesterday of ignoring the hate and focusing on the positive because I do get so many positive messages. Someone in the comments yesterday suggested screenshotting and saving all of the messages that are wonderful to look at when I'm feeling down or feeling like there's no love on this app. And that's a great idea. And so I'm going to begin doing that and as I save them uh, I'm gonna read some of them to you guys not to boost myself uh, publicly and say like I'm so great but to share all the amazing stuff behind the scenes on how these videos are unexpectedly helping other people and sometimes expectedly in the ways that I had hoped so let's get started the first message hi I love 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 your videos I actually have dermatillomania which you may be familiar with but it's a kind of OCD that has made me pick at my own skin to a really harmful degree in the past I don't have EPPK so watching your content really gives me a psychological sense of comfort and relief through my whole body that I literally didn't know was possible until your account first came on my for you page now I can't stop coming back because of the ease it gives to my OCD thank you please keep doing what you're doing Wow, and it's incredible to hear this because I never expected that my videos would help people with this condition, but there are other messages like this. Another woman writes, hey, I just wanted to let you know your videos have helped me so much. I know this may sound odd, but I have OCD and a skin picking disorder. Watching your videos are honestly satisfying to me and keep me from picking my skin so much. Another message just like this. Hi, you probably won't see this, but I just want to say thank you. I have dermatillomania and OCD, which is a terrible combo. Nothing has helped me until your videos. I know you have to live with it, but sharing your experience has kept me from destroying my own skin. So genuinely, thank you, and please don't stop posting. I'm sorry TikTok's being weird, but thank you. Thank you for watching. I'm so happy my videos could help with these conditions that I never realized they might help with. I just figured maybe I would reach people with my condition. Um, and I do, and those messages are coming. But the next message is from someone who has a different type of condition, but who finds kinship and uh, relation to what I'm going through. She says, I struggle with hyperhidrosis, excessive sweating on my whole body, hands and feet included. I relate to your page in such a unique way because I understand the uncomfortableness that comes with the inability to have quote unquote soft, normal hands and feet. I'm on the opposite side of your condition, but I'm shocked at how much I relate. You are a beautiful person and a mother, and I just wanted to say thank you for sharing your journey. You're welcome. You're welcome. I didn't realize I could be so brave. Another message, I'm so glad I came across your channel. You have finally given a name to this hereditary disorder I have struggled with and been insecure with for 35 years of my life. So insecure to even show a doctor. My case is definitely mild, but I have to shave about every week. Side note, I don't think that's mild. I think that's pretty severe like mine. Uh, then I lather up with amlactin and wear socks. I also use amlactin, 15%. I got this curse, I don't think it's a curse, but I understand what she's saying, from my dad since I'm just a girl form of him. I didn't know others like me existed. I'm sorry you and your son go through this. I'm grateful that you have the confidence to post this content. It has been helpful and I've gained some insight. And finally, the last message, you have no idea how thankful I am for your page. I've spent my whole life not understanding why my skin was the way it was and having no idea how to fix it. Doctors were useless. You've showed me how to live comfortably and have sensation again. You've changed my life. Mwah. I love you guys. Thank you for watching. Come back tomorrow for the big toe. Woohoo. Bye.